AutoCAD Electrical has the ability to insert fixed or parametric PLCs. We're going to create a fixed PLC in this particular video. Select Symbol Builder, select your objects that represent the PLC, define a base point. As the connections of this device are coming in vertically, it's a vertical parent. We can define the tag as PLC and insert all of the required attributes very quickly. Go down to wire connections. We can choose a left, a top, a bottom, a right connection with no graphics. Or we can go to others to define some graphics. And we're going to have a screw on top. We'll have six of them with a spacing of 10 millimeters. And we can define the pin number and the function. So the terminal number, such, and the function. Let's reposition these attributes ever so slightly. So that they're more centralised. Now we'll have a look at a PLC terminal. Let's repeat the previous command. Fix PLC for offset 10, terminal 7, terminal 8. Terminal 7's description is DI1. Change the properties where necessary for the orientation and the justification. Repeat the same process for all the remaining terminals. An analog input typically has two terminals. One is just defined as a screw. And the other is defined as a fixed PLC once happy with the graphics if you wish to have more than two lines of description information for an input or an output simply just copy the attribute next to it and change it to for example desk C12, desk D12 and desk E12. You're allowed up to five lines of descriptions for a individual input or output. Once you're happy with that you can test your block to see whether it looks okay. You can close the test block, make any changes that are required, and then close the block editor. In this instance, we won't create an image. If you are saving it to the library, it's a W block. You specify where you're saving it to. A PLC symbol should be called PLCIO to begin with as a prefix for it to be understood as a PLC. 
and then you can call it whatever you want thereafter. So as an example, PLC space example. Thank you.